Recently, I polled my subscribers by asking them the question, what type of custom thumbnail do you add to your shorts video? 41% said I don't know how to add a custom shorts thumbnail. So in this video, I'm gonna show you how to select a frame from your shorts video to use as a custom thumbnail, whether you have an iPhone or Android device. Here's how to do it. Tap the YouTube app, tap the plus sign, tap create a short, tap 15 to lengthen it to 60 seconds, tap the red button to record a short, or tap add to add one from your camera roll. I'm gonna add this one. Tap done, tap the check icon, tap next, tap the pencil icon. Now I can select any frame from my short. I'm gonna choose this one, tap done, caption the short, tap visibility to select public, unlisted or private or schedule it. Tap upload short. Now it's uploading my short, tap library. You can see how my shorts thumbnail looks like. You can also see how the thumbnail will appear on your channel pages, recommendations on YouTube's homepage, on videos listed on the subscriptions tab, and in YouTube search results. The only place you won't see any thumbnails is in the Shorts feed, where your Shorts videos play automatically as viewers swipe through it. Here's an important note from YouTube. It's not currently possible to change the thumbnail after your short has been uploaded, but we look forward to bringing this feature to you in the future. When I ask my subscribers, what type of custom thumbnail do you add to your Shorts video? 19% said, I upload a regular horizontal thumbnail. But how can you upload a regular horizontal thumbnail from your computer when YouTube says, for now, you can't change the thumbnail on your short? Here's a workaround. Click on the content tab in YouTube Studio and select the shorts video you wanna add a custom thumbnail to. Click on details. It's currently showing a vertical thumbnail that YouTube has automatically selected. It says, for now, you can't change the thumbnail on your short, but if you have the free Chrome extension vidIQ installed, you'll see this blue icon called Create Thumbnail. Click on that. Click Drop File here or Browse for Files. I'm gonna select this horizontal thumbnail from my computer. Click Open, click Next, click Next again. It says this is what your thumbnail will look like around the web on YouTube, Facebook, and Twitter. Click Save Thumbnail, click Close. Now if I reload the page, it shows the horizontal thumbnail that I created instead of the vertical thumbnail. Keep in mind a regular horizontal thumbnail won't appear in YouTube search or in the shorts feed, but it will appear in Google search. Another way to upload a custom thumbnail for YouTube short is to use the TubeBuddy Chrome extension. I'll place a link in the description. Click on the TubeBuddy icon that says TubeBuddy Tools. Click on Thumbnail Generator. Click on Image or Existing Thumbnail. Click on this banner that says click to upload your own image. Select your image. Click Open. Select your thumbnail. Click Continue. Click Continue. Here it will show all the competing thumbnails on YouTube. Click Save and Publish. Are you sure you want to publish this thumbnail? Click OK. And here's my thumbnail. Just keep in mind you can only upload a custom horizontal thumbnail for your short using your computer. If you want to know how to make your YouTube shorts go viral, watch the video on the screen right now on how to use TubeBuddy's suggested shorts tool to find the most engaging parts of a long form video. You'll be glad you did.